another episode of Chipper Chef with Charlie. A special episode today because we are on location with Rod Lund. Rod, how are you doing today? Doing well. Super duper, Rod. All right, so let's get right into this. All right, um, you're, we're here today because you let us come into your studio, right? Now, one of the things that's very confusing, uh, th that might be confusing about this is, what is the difference between a studio and a studio apartment? It seems really confusing. Well, generally, a studio apartment is where you live. <laughs> right. A studio is generally more in terms of where you work to co record a record or mm. an album. Or a cassette, cassette tape. You know, okay. no, more, more like an, a song or album. Ah, okay. Oh, that makes sense. Okay, so, uh, so we're here today. You let us come in your studio today because this is where you live. Is that right? Uh, this is actually where I'm cutting a record. Oh, okay. Okay, so so you're recording music with all this junk over here. Is that right? Yep. Okay. Well, that's a lot of neat stuff you got over there. Okay. Nice. Your guitar's pretty sweet. This actually is um is a 1967 Gibson Sunburst, which was actually owned no, no, no. previously by Bob Dylan. Bob Dylan? Mm -hmm. The Bob Dylan. The Bob Dylan. He was like on the Chicago Bulls for like three years. One of the best three point shooters of all time. That's amazing. Anyway, no, guitar. Was Bob Dylan, the singer songwriter. Oh. It's like a Rolling Stone, Blowing in the Wind, Knocking on Heaven's Door. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I've heard of him. So, okay. Um, so, you have this guitar. I mean, what? how'd you get the guitar? That's kind of a weird thing to have Bob Dylan's guitar. Well, actually, I was going to a celebrity auction, just kind of looking at the right. memorabilia and kind of see. Um, some different stuff by, you know, some hey, hey, musicians. Hey, hey, on. What's this? Is this a tambourine? That's a tambourine. It's a pretty sweet, sweet tambourine. Is this yours? That's mine. Alright. That's cool. That's cool. I'm oh, sorry, go on. So, like I was saying about the guitar, right. I, was, I went to the auction and, you know, I actually was just kind of looking was to it, see was it, in. was it in Chicago by any chance? No, um, actually it was in Arizona. I almost got you, Rod. <laughs> All right, go on, go on. So like I was saying, I went just to kind of look around for memorabilia and right. see some of the old guitars and stuff, and this one came up for auction. I was a, just a Wait, enormous um, Bob Dylan fan, so speaking, I... Speaking, Hank, sh shut up. Bob Dylan. Now, did, did he own this tambourine as well? Um, he didn't own that tambourine. He didn't own the tambourine? Okay. Where'd you get the tambourine? It's pretty sweet. Store. Oh, like iTunes? No, not iTunes. Oh. It's more like a guitar center or something. Oh, okay. I, I don't know what that is. Okay. I'm sorry. Keep, keep going. So, like I was saying, right. that this guitar came up for auction and I didn't plan on bidding, but price is right, and I decided Wait. to do something right. that was great. Hey. Shut up again. Hang on. You hear that? Yeah. You know what that is? Uh, no, <laughs> no, it's a song. Hang on. Wait, here it goes. What if God was one of us? Two, three, four. Just a slob like one of us. <laughs> I like that song. You remember that song when it came out? That was a good song. Hang on, Rod. Wait, I got a better idea. What if? Hang on. What if Rod was one of us? Two, three, four. Just a rod like one of us. <laughs> oh, good times. All right. Well, that's all the time we have for today. I want to thank my guest, uh, Rod Lund, for coming in. Uh, check out his stuff on rodlund.com. Keep checking out Chipper Chats and keep checking out ch uh, chickencrossing.net. Boom.